Hello, Internet. We need to talk. You left me all alone for a week and a half, not being able to compute, not being able to check my YouTube account, not being able to complain on my crappy webcam, not being able to visually oogle a Canadian. I could accept that for a couple of days. In fact, I was going to thank you, Internet. I had become too attached to you. So I started watching TV again. It was nice for a while, but then it started to make me cry. Why? Because, Internet, you left me hanging. This is what I've been watching. Car commercials with techno beats in the background. Car commercial advertisements are trying to be cool by setting their commercials to a techno beat. <laughs> Look, the car can go this way, it can go that way. Do a techno beat! Uh, people, uh, we, we don't care about the beat, we care about the price. And, you know, if the car will still run after 50,000 miles. Charmin toilet paper commercial. I get your concept, Charmin. A, does a bear shit in the woods? Yes, it does. But we don't care about cartoon bears that have flecks of toilet paper stuck to their anus. Cha-cha-cha. Let's see what else. The Snuggie Corporation, putting out more Snuggies in crazy cool patterns, and now they've got Snuggies for dogs. I blame you, Internet. I wouldn't have had to watch that shit if you were here, but you weren't here, man. That stupid ass above the influence commercial with the girl who gets too stoned at a party and the, her friends paint her face and put strings on her wrist and she's a, oh look, she's a passed out marionette. <laughs> okay. Um, that can also happen when you're too drunk at a party, but you don't see any commercials saying don't drink at a party. You only see commercials that say don't drink and drive. Not too many please don't smoke cigarettes kids commercials, just kids don't smoke marijuana commercials. Oh yeah, and Patrick Swayze died. I blame you, Internet. But now you're back, and you've thrown your little temper tantrum, and I can forgive that. Don't let it happen again. Do you know why, Internet? Because the absolute worst thing has happened now, and there's nothing I can do to stop it. I could have, if you were here for me, but you weren't here, man. You know what happened? Nathan Forst has a Twitter account. And Nathan, if if I weren't crazy about you, I would pay Big Joey to kick your ass. He doesn't like Twitter either. Don't let it happen again, Internet.